Well, it's important because essentially when it comes to matters of health, we're very much in the dark. So any access to information is useful. It can be reassuring. Well, it's good if it's clear. If it's, um, it doesn't have to not have, you know, professional jargon in it. But if there is professional jargon, there needs to be an explanation. Um, it needs to be well structured. And one of the most important things as far as I'm concerned is it leads to somewhere. It's not just information, but it takes you on the journey. Recently, my partner's got terminal cancer, so I mean, that's one of the things that I've been looking at. And uh, Macmillan's stuff is, is very good. Advice on what the emotional effects are, what the mental effects are, what the physical effects are, and also something about relationship, because it's not only the person who has cancer, it's the carers. And if there's sort of any weakness in terms of leaflets, is it's that they're directed very much towards the person who's ill, which is absolutely right, but ignore the person who's the carer. And it's a bit of a difficult job to do in a leaflet, but I mean it can be done by means of, of diagrams and things like that, and a range of leaflets. Well, yeah, I think one of the key things is that a leaflet is only a start, and it's important to know of agencies, and also to know from the agencies what they can do and what they can't do, so what their remit is. And I have to say that generally agencies are not very good on that one.